good to be back. What is going on everybody? But welcome back to another daily vlog. We're finally back here at the one and only Disney World. If you guys are new on here, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button, thumbs the video up, and ring that bell, become part of the one and only notification squad. So we're here at Epcot. This is the park that I chose to come back to first. And it looks like we're already starting construction on the left-hand side for the Leave a Legacy removal. They've already removed the right side, and now they're finally working on the left side like I predicted that they would in about a couple weeks when I did post that update video. But let's head on in. I'm super duper excited to be here, guys. It's been, it's been about a week. <laughs> and everybody having Disney withdrawal. And let's go on in. Here we go. Thank you. Here we go. We are back, baby. We are back, guys. Here is a look on how the traffic flow is operating right now with the walls and the removal of the legacy. Looks like they only have one more row to go, so they must have been doing this while I've been, been gone for quite a while. And then we just walk on into Epcot. You can only go on the right-hand side, but there's only about three more statues left to be removed. And then it's completely gone. Spaceship Earth, always a, a little bit more of a wait in the morning, 25 minutes. Not too, not too bad, not too shabby. I'd wait 25 minutes for Spaceship Earth. I'm telling you guys, Epcot is about to go through a huge construction phase, but I'm really, really excited about it. I did a video about it uh, a while ago on all the updates, so if any of you guys have any questions, feel free to comment down below and I'll answer them on uh, any of the updates you guys don't know anything about. But, first of all, food and wine. Food and wine is coming. August 29th through November 23rd. That is my favorite, favorite event here at Epcot. Food and wine, can't get enough food, can't get enough alcohol. Super duper excited about that. That is starting actually when Star Wars Galaxy Edge opens August 29th as well. So, not gonna lie, probably gonna be going to Galaxy's Edge opening day if I have off. Oh, it's so good to be back. I hope you guys are as excited as I am because I'm like literally shaking right now to be back in Disney after a week. I had withdrawal, guys. I had withdrawal. It is a hot one out today. Holy smokes. It is hot. I'm just dripping sweat right now. Definitely one thing I didn't miss was the humidity, the hotness. It's absolutely disgusting. Can't wait for October. I love October. That's my favorite month here in Disney World. Ooh, look at the pretty flowers. The pretty flowers walking in the World Showcase. There's actually an event going on today, guys. There's a, it's a pin training event. Real quick before I forget here, um, shout out to Elizabeth L. Thank you for coming down below. That's a new way that I, I'm gonna be incorporating you guys in my vlogs. If you guys wanna be in my vlogs, comment down below. So Elizabeth L, thank you for commenting. And uh, yeah, go pack go. The pin event that I was talking about is going on today. It's called Fairy Tales. It's gonna be over here in the UK pavilion, right on over here. It's a huge pin event that a lot of pin traders go to. We're gonna meet one today. One of my friends, she's huge with pins. You guys know who she is already. It's uh, Disney Kitty, Becca, my good friend. But uh, right on over here, this is where the Fairy Tales pin event is happening. Now it's a paid event, so you actually had to have paid ahead of time. It's sold out, it sells out really fast, and that's when they have some really cool pins for sale, some limited edition ones, and it's me in that pavilion. Unfortunately, I do not have a pass, but let's go talk to Becca about it real quick. I don't know if Becca's been drinking or not. My guess is yeah, because it's Epcot, and who doesn't drink at Epcot when you're over 21? Freaking best place to drink. <laughs> Looks like we got Alice over here. Probably talking about some tea and stuff. Couldn't really tell you, that's probably the conversation. No. Becca! Hello, What's up? Hi. How's it going? Doing good. Hello, shalom. You're back. I'm back. I'm back. We're both back. We're both We're back. back. Hey. Yeah, hey. How was the event? Um, it's like a lot of standing in a lot in line with pin people. Can I see your pins that you got? Uh, I can show you a couple. Okay. I have a friend that wants to meet you though. Okay, cool, cool, cool. <laughs> this is John right here. And John is a pin collector. Check out all these pins that he has. Yeah. You want to you show it to us? Absolutely, absolutely. These are not for trade, Okay. but these are pretty nice. So everything in here is not for trade? Just these aren't, but everything else pretty much is. Oh, and snap. How many do you have? On me now, about 200. 200? In general, I got about 1,000. That's crazy. <laughs> I have 2,000. You have to, oh, Jesus, Becca. Becca. Wow. Wow. Yeah. I thought I had a lot, and I only have 80. That's <laughs> <laughs> a lot. Is it? It's all right. Becca, what, what are you showing? What are you about to show us? The, the biggest pin you've ever seen. Okay. Size matters. <laughs> you can edit that out. Yeah. Oh my gosh. This is, this is one pin. It's basically like... As big as your hand. It's basically like a weapon. What the heck? It's... And it comes with a little stand on it. Isn't that crazy? So it's got all the Disney animals on it. Yeah. And uh, what does that retail at? 
125. It's not bad. It's, it's kind of bad. <laughs> Before we venture on in to Epcot, there's something I do in each and every single video. It's called Jump Around. Do you guys know what time it is? It's time to jump, jump around. Jump around. Jump around. Jump around. Jump up, jump up and get down. We're gonna head on over to uh, Mexico and get a margarita. 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 It's like the best drink here at Disney, I'm telling you. The best drink that there is. The Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. It's great. It's there's great. There's no lime? That's not even a margarita. It's, you don't need lime for a margarita. Am I right? Yes. Margarita. The clouds are out right now and it's absolutely beautiful because there's no sun beating down on us. This is what it should be like every day. Each and every single day. Each and every single day. Each and every single day. I know. I know it. I know yeah. it now. <laughs> yes. yes. Yeah. I'll watch you sometimes. Oh, it's down. Look, the walls are down. They've taken the walls down here in America. They redid this brickwork. This is brand new for food and wine. If you guys remember, there was walls over there, and this is the update. And then we got the food and wine building for America. Nice. Really cool update. And then, of course, later on this year, right on over here. Just to the left of the American Adventure, we're bringing that brand new barbecue restaurant over here. That's gonna be opening later this year. We've made it to Margaritaville. Here we go. Good timing too because I haven't had any water or anything and um, my throat is very, very dry. So Margarita's gonna hit the spot. Everyone's got their cameras out. Shout out your channel. Uh, Disney Kitty. I was like, what's my channel? Disney Kitty. Happily ever eating. Boom, follow them down below. We got three cameras. Three cameras, guys. <laughs> Shout out to Becca. She's gonna get the fiesta for me. It's amazing tonight. I'm just shooting the sugar mama. We met at the Blue Bar TV. <laughs> Sometime we're gonna go. Yeah, there. it's right by my house. That's yeah. what I thought you So you know about it, right? Yeah? Yeah. So the, the Winnie the Pooh is a fiesta without the lime over there. Look at how good that looks. Doesn't that look good? Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. We're gonna go inside Mexico because it is just absolutely disgusting out other than the margaritas because I'm dripping sweat. Literally dripping sweat. Coco. Comment down below if you guys agree. It should be Coco. I love Coco. Why should be Coco? It's quite my face off. So guys, you're not going to believe what uh, we might do. Do not like this ride at all. We're about to ride the one and only Figment. 25 minutes. <laughs> that's the I'm real about to ride Figment for a uh, 25 minute wait. 25 minutes. 25 I think minutes. that's safe to say I've ever... Like the that's longest I've waited for Figment. The best Not really. <laughs> this is like a once in a lifetime thing right now. <laughs> I'll never. Opportunity. Yeah, I'm only doing this because Becca's here. Opportunity, yeah. I'm here with birds, okay? <laughs> oh my god. This is happening. Kind of crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we made it! Oh you my god. This is weird. Moving on to a little bit of, of a, a way better ride, not a little bit. The seas we find in Nemo. Yeah, it's mine, so much. Mine, 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 yeah. mine. Yeah. Mine. I can kind of do it. All right. We're gonna ride. We're gonna ride this. Seas with. Me. It's so much easier to vlog with another YouTuber because, like, when you vlog with another YouTuber, it just like puts everything out of perspective, meaning you forget about other people around you, and you're just kind of like in the vlogging zone. Yeah, we're really annoying. People yeah, right now. <laughs> pretty much. Mine? Together. We swim together. All right, everybody, that is gonna be it for today's daily vlog. We are back here at Disney World, living the life, living the dream. The new chapter has begun here at Disney World. Oh, big puddle. But if you guys happen to be new around here, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button, thumbs the video up. Also, go ahead and go over to Becca. She's my good friend. Yeah. Give her some love in YouTube her video. Friends. 
please go give her some love and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's daily vlog and like always bang, bang. Yeah. Big Man. You're welcome. I spoiled it. You didn't spoil it. <laughs>